man. <laughs> we can take it over here. We're gonna start. <laughs> so we're gonna start over here. We're not gonna show Rumi's side very much. She's a very kind lady and she said I could, but but I don't think that that matters that much. So this is the closet. Everyone say ooh, everyone say ah. Ooh, ah. Okay, so there's two drawers. This one has all of my intimates in it, so I'm not gonna show you that. It has all my panties and my <laughs> bras, so that's what's in there. Then this one is where I keep all of my pants, in case anyone needs to know how many pants you can fit in here. 15 pairs of pants in this drawer, so big drawers. <laughs> I got big drawers. Can't count that number on your hands. <laughs> You sure can. <laughs> and then we open up the closet. Here I have my Ooh. beach bag, my robes that I literally never use. Oh, I love um, mine. I, uh, that's the thing, it's, it's so like hit or miss if you like them or not. Okay, me and Delia wear them when it's hot out. After oh. our shower, we just want to breathe, you know? Oh, I just brought my towel around me. <laughs> they like to be naked. We do like to be naked. Is what they're saying. You know what, me and my roommate are naked too sometimes. It's kind of so. just like a bond. It is, like be naked with your roommate. It <laughs> might bring you guys closer. N naked party? That's a thing in college, guys. You guys will experience so many naked parties when you get here. It's a big <laughs> UH Manoa thing. Be ready to be comfortable with your naked self. That's On that note, all of these clothes, we never wear them because we're always naked. In here, we have a lot of stuff. If, you, if, we, if we come in here really quick, we can see my giant stack of jean shorts with some shoes stuff behind there. And we have my camera bag in here. We have nine, ten pairs of shoes in this closet. And then a million and a half tank tops on just this side. I do like eight tank tops to a hanger. So oh my god. I love me my tank tops. Then we can open up this side. This is where I keep my towels. Up here is just my sheets and some bags and like first aid stuff. Fun fact about me, I haven't had my period since I got here. So the only people who have used these tampons are my friends who've run out of tampons. And then I say, guys, I actually have a supply. A girl's girl. <sighs> a girl's girl. And then in here, I just have all of my other clothes. There's a lot of clothes in here. Here's all of my, like, I call these, like, my my cute t-shirts. This is, like, oh, these are my cutesy t-shirts. You know what I mean? Then we have long sleeves and hoodies. Which I actually wear way more hoodies than I think most people would think. That's this many long sleeves and hoodies. I did ask my mom to bring me some back because I work at Urban and the fitting rooms are freezing cold but also in the winter months you might get chilly and then oh my god i forgot about this dress <laughs> camilla gave me this dress i'm gonna wear this soon because i actually forgot about it but camilla gave it to me for my birthday and then i have some skirts dresses dresses i also put like multiple dresses on a hanger life hack i guess and then i have extra towels down there i have this <laughs> rack i put my towels here when they're still wet and then dry them and then put them down there just because things get so humid up here <laughs> Don't look at those. Here we have my shoe box, which with power of deductive reasoning, you can tell what's in there. Um, this bin has like camping stuff from the one time we went camping. My yoga mat that I've literally never used. And this box, there's sand on it. Box. box, okay? When I moved here, my mother surprised me with getting my loved ones and everyone like that to write me letters that all had like a certain scenario on them to open. They're called my open when letters. In case you're wondering, I keep like every birthday card and every letter I've ever been given. So I'm sentimental like that. <laughs> if you take a look, they're all open now, but they're all like these little open when things and all of my letters. And I go back to them sometimes. For some reason you're a mother and you're watching this, please do this because this is the most meaningful thing. Genuinely helped me get through my first semester. Hard knock time. It was a hard knock life, actually. It's a hard knock oh, life duh. for us. <laughs> and you can also see on my bed, I actually have hung up some of the, the notes and stuff. I have this one from my mom and then pictures that were in them. This is my aunt, dad, and my uncle. And then this is me and my dad. And then this is me and my brother. All of these came from those little notes. These are from my mom. And this is from my little cousin. It's really cute. This was all that the letter was, in case you were wondering. It was literally just this picture of a pig farting a bubble. Um, that brings us to the bed. Here's my bed. I love these blankets. They're really nice and light. They're like perfect for here, in my opinion, but people have comforters and they're fine too. And then if it's cold, I just double up. Under the bed, we have Ooh. laundry, ah. backpacks, suitcase. This is full of stuff I've thrifted for my new house. Fridge, it's a very small fridge. I actually had my original fridge break on me because I was stabbing it out of anger. I was stabbing the ice out of it and then it started spraying chemicals at me and I could have died. I slammed the door, you know, as Sabrina says, oh, there's a tear literally leaving my eye right now for some reason. I slammed the door, hit ignore. <laughs> and bought myself a new fridge. 
And then over here, oh, I guess you can look back here. Don't look in my trash can. We have some tubes, Fairlife protein shakes, air mattress. This is stuff I have to give my brother. Little bo boogie boards that my family bought and I've never used. <sighs> this is just emotional for me. No way I'm leaving this place. <laughs> Dude, in like five days, if I, not even in five, in like two days if I get this house, I'm gonna start packing up. Isn't that insane? Let's get a replay on that jaw drop. <laughs> Over here, let's bring you to the shelves. Over here, we have my medication, <laughs> my earrings, tissues, a coaster. And then if we go up here, we have all of my books. On a scale of one to nine, how many of these do you guys think I've actually read? The answer Wait, that was like more one to nine. One. And one of them is a journal. So I actually wrote one of those books up there. <laughs> Deepest, darkest thoughts are actually in here. <laughs> I'm going through a breakup, so... <laughs> There's some words on these pages that we'll never it's see. It's a hard knock time. <laughs> it's a hard knock time, for sure. Then I have this book. This book came in one of those open when things. It was a little gift. And it's just a bunch of pictures of me and my family. I sobbed uncontrollably when I opened this one. Oh, look at this picture of me and my dogs. Aww. The nails. <laughs> Sorry. My Neato's up here. I have this Barbie. This is a picture of me and my family. Candle that I... A candle that I got from, um, <laughs> a man Ooh, who I Ooh. ghosted. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> then we come to my Taylor Swift shrine. These are, I got from a luau when Mar came. My mom painted me this and sent it in a care package. By the way, your parents are going to be like, I'm going to send you care packages all the time. They're going to stop. You might get one or two. And I then it's, got a single one. Yeah, boom. Honestly, my mom did a better job than most, so... If you're expecting care packages, whatever they are. But we still love them. We do. We, Us to our parents. This is my heiress to her shrine. That's that. I got these from the movie. This is my sex wax. These are just some Polaroids from home with some friendship bracelets I got from girl, little girls at the movie. That sounds kind of whack. Empty perfume bottles because you get stinky here and I go through a lot of perfume. This is my other's heiress to her thing. This is from the sh first show I went to. And then this guitar pick um, actually is basically from Taylor Swift herself. One of the lovely women I met here named Maddie. She's super cute. She worked security at a show for Taylor and her dad came and gave all of them, like t Taylor Swift's dad, Scott Swift, Came and gave them all guitar picks. And then I just have some, I have a picture of my dad up here. We're so cute. Look at us. Love my dad. Here I have some cups and a painting that I painted like three years ago. Okay, and then in these bins, we're gonna just like run through them really quickly. More cups. In here I have laundry soap, t-shirts, lots of t-shirts, sleep shorts and sleep sets, I guess. But I only have one sleep set, so sleep shorts and sleep set. Cause we're naked all the time. Woo! Woo! And in here I have all of my swimsuits. In here I have all of my workout clothes. So it's all my sports bras and all of my shorts underneath. Moving over here. This is my key card thing. I have my debit and credit card and then my student ID and my room key in it. Totally recommend one of these. I recommend if they actually stick to your phone, but I didn't want to stick this one to my phone because my phone case is too pretty. When we come to the appliances, we have an ice maker. 10 out of 10 recommend an ice maker. So great. This is my air fryer. This is my coffee maker. Lighting. Here's a little espresso machine. Britta. Um, is that pink? Yeah, my Britta's pink. Okay, Barbie. It's also a knockoff Britta. I got it from Amazon. Paper towel holder, all of my necklaces. In here, I keep all of my cords and wires under here. Mirror, pens, pencils, makeup brushes, stuff, stuff, stuff. Over here's my shower caddy. This is disgusting. Don't look at this. And my two fans. Totally recommend having two fans. This is a wuzu. Everyone loves a wuzu. Get you a wuzu. <laughs> oh, I guess we can come to these drawers over here. In this drawer, I keep hair stuff mostly. I also have this tiara. Look at those Should I wear spots. this for the rest of the video? Duh. Here is a random drawer. I have seasonings, plates, hair curlers, silverware. And then in here is my snack drawer. She is not as full as she usually is because of some stupid dumb boys on my floor who are for some reason always fucking hungry. I didn't even mention this. This is my, I was gonna wear this, but it's too hot right now. This is my crew, UH Manila. Go Bows! Quarter zip. Quarter, quarter zip. zip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, quarter zip. That's Go Bows! 
we're almost done we just have these three drawers in this drawer i have all of my makeup more makeup skincare stuff nail stuff nail stuff vitamins pre-workout creatine lotion q-tips another random drawer these are all the shampoos and conditioners my mom has bought when she's come to visit and then she leaves them with me and she's like here you don't need to buy shampoo and conditioner now mom i haven't even gotten through the one that you bought me in november here's all of my shells in this Aww. super cute cup that reina got me um yeah shells love them i also have all of my jewelry making stuff in here like extra wallpaper um and then here's my other food drawer and this is like real food it's a little bit of a mess but so there's tortillas bread noodles pancake mix my pots and pans a random loofah as well don't forget the loofah you never know you never know Raina's side we this is a communal drawer it's just all of our cleaning stuff oh the dog push was crazy <laughs> This is a little guy that I made in the dining hall one night. They'll have these random nights where they're like, where they're like, hey, come do this random ass thing. And that's literally what it is. And this one was rock painting. So this is my cute little bikini rock. She's missing an eye. Here's my view. It's these houses. And this is Mokihana. She's cute. And then if you look that way, you can actually see Diamond Head. Get it really up close and personal. Oh, oh, yep, there you go. <laughs> so that was my room tour. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this video. I hope it was helpful. This if it wasn't bad. helpful, I'm really, really sorry, Elle. You know what I mean? Bella, out. Bella, <laughs> Bella, out. <laughs> Miss you didn't get close. I'm like, Bella, Bella, out. <laughs> <laughs> All right.